Mother Nature wasn't going to stop these dedicated shoppers from getting a good deal. I love all of the, the things that they create here. Just makes me happy. And neither was distance. We left last night. We drove six hours just so we could be here for the start of the sale today. Char Boyd traveled all the way from Toledo, Ohio, to check the Mackenzie Child's barn sale off her bucket list. At my age, like I said, you uh, have a bucket list. And number three on my bucket list was to go to the barn sale at Mackenzie Child's. Hardcore fans waited in line for hours in the oppressive heat and humidity this morning to get into the annual sale. After coming for the past four years, Ariel Fleming and her mom know how to beat the heat. So we bring our chairs and what we're doing is we're taking turns. One person sits in the shade and the other one keeps um, our place in line. Just when there seemed to be no choice but to camp out by the fan, Mother Nature had a change of heart. And all of a sudden, the umbrella bin became the most popular destination. But despite the weather, they all took it in stride. I got a dog bed. So I drove six hours for a dog bed. That's crazy. but. Because rain or shine, they're walking out with the bargains they've been waiting for. We're not selling anything here that you need. We're selling everything that you want. It is absolutely worth it. If you're familiar with Mackenzie Child, it's a wonderful product. And the barn sale, they definitely give you a nice discount. It's worth your while for making the trek. So if you're looking for a great deal and willing to weather any condition, whether it be sweltering heat or pouring rain, don't worry, because the Mackenzie Child's barn sale runs until Sunday. Reporting from Aurora, I'm Dora Scheidel.